Hey y'all, welcome back, or welcome if you're new. This is uh, Dan from DM Website Design. So, what I wanted to go over today with you guys is briefly how important images are for your website and how to optimize those images. Meaning such things as how fast, how big, what kind of file, etc. So, one big factor you also need to remember is it needs to be responsive. Responsive meaning it will be able to fit on any screen, on any device. From iPhone, laptop, iPad, etc. So this is Divi where I'm working on this blog. And uh, Divi is a fairly simple builder. So when you're optimizing images, okay, there are such things well they're different according to each search engine all right so i'm gonna mainly just uh briefly go over google versus bing so with bing it has much more importance for the user's experience um for Google to notice you better. Now, when you're talking about the media, it could be whether it's a picture, it can be a video, it always has to have some tag and title behind it. So, you know, these are some just random images. So I'm gonna show you, okay, let's just click on a random one. All right, so right here, it's called your alternative text, alt, your alt text. What the alt text is very important. That is what you are showing to Google the image, what it is. Not only that, if the image does not show up for some reason, it will display your alt text. So... You know, just as an example, you know, this for our alt text also is always going to be determining on our blog or whatnot. So you always want the images to be uh, close. So this has most wanted WordPress tips, tricks, and hacks. So this is for a different blog that I'd wrote. It was WordPress tips pretty much. So, my alt text would be WordPress tips. Next is your title tag. This is just as important, if not more. This is where you're going to show the search engine what the title of it is, which is more important than the alternative text. However, the alternative text is more important for user experience. And as I had said, user experience always comes first. With Bing, their search engine focuses a lot more on to on-page SEO and you know images, videos, all types of media. And it, behind each one, you have to have the alt text, your title, you know, etc. Now, when it comes to images, there are several plugins that will be optimal to optimize images. The one I use is called Smush. Great, great. Uh, it's free. Or you could buy a purchased one and it'll do more. But it smushes 
your your images, which means they're getting compressed so they are smaller in order to create your website to be faster, the images to show, and it'll tell you exactly how much it is, okay? So there's 385 images. For free, you can get up to 50 images smushed. So this is going to compress them all into JPEGs. Now, there can be PNG, whatever it is. When you put them into WordPress, they change into a JPEG picture. And JPEG is better than a PNG picture because it is smaller and it is much faster. And there's always benefits more and more. So I'm kind of going on. I wanted to just explain how important the visuals are on your website for user experience and Google, Bing, all other search engines. All right, guys. Well, if you uh, like this one, just smash like. If you have any questions or you're running into any personal problems with your website, please just comment below and I'd be happy to make a video about how to overcome that issue you're having. Um, give me a, a follow and you will see all of my new videos as they come up. So once again, I will see you guys soon.